first order of myth busting business is that we as humans are supposed to be carnivores. And that really doesn't hold up on its face with a basic amount of research. All carnivores are able to produce their own vitamin C. We have to get it from fruits and vegetables. If we don't, we get a disease called scurvy. It's a problem. It, it's not a good look for us. We don't feel good. And it's corrected with vitamin C. All carnivores, lions, like anything that just solely eats meat can produce its own vitamin C. We cannot. The next argument for why we should be carnivores is that our teeth are designed to be eating meat because they don't look like a plant eater's teeth. Like, okay, cool. But they also don't look like a lion's teeth. They don't look like a bear's teeth, which are made for like ripping and tearing flesh. We have a teeth in the back called molars that are made for crushing. We do have canines. Canines, I guess, are part of what you would have in the dentition of a predator, but we don't fully have the dentition of a predator. We don't fully have the dentition of a quote unquote leaf eater. If you like to watch them more time shows, we have a mixture of both. And then on alcohol, so paleo says that you can't have alcohol because that's not good for you. And it's not, and they're right, but they're not right for the reason they think. There is proof that humans were eating and drinking alcohol. They were fermenting honey, fruit, and grains from as recent as 10,000 years ago, which is right about when paleo kind of ends. So there was at least a little bit of an overlap. So your, your paleo caveman may have had a buzz. I don't know, but certainly possible.